Hey, it's Rob from Axel's Garage, and I was just shooting a video about doing a battery replacement on my 2003 GMC Yukon XL. So I had a battery that I bought new in March of 2013. Now, I bought it out of state. I bought it down in Midlothian, Virginia. That's just outside of Richmond. And I, when I bought it in 2013, who knows what I did with the receipt, but what the deal was back then, if you bought the Gold Series battery, it was a three-year replacement warranty or a five-year uh, prorated warranty. So what the deal was, if the battery went bad within the first three years, you got a new battery. But if the battery went bad in years four or five, they prorated it based on how many months you had left and they divided by your original purchase price, multiplied by how many months you had left, blah, 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 and that's how much credit you got towards the purchase of your replacement battery. So now it's December 2016 and the battery took a dump. So what did I do? Yeah, I went to my local advanced auto parts in, uh, what is that, Floral Park? That's Floral Park. Advanced auto parts on Jericho Turnpike in Floral Park. And I went in and I said, I got this battery. And the guy showed me what battery options I could have. And I picked the battery, which was the same battery that I had. And he says, it's $139. And I said, what about my credit? He goes, oh, well, that's a $5 core credit. Are you going to drop the battery off? I said, yeah, I'm going to drop the battery off. And he wanted to give me a $5 core credit for the battery. I said, what about my warranty credit? He goes, oh, you don't get any warranty credit. I said, what do you mean? What do you mean I don't get any warranty credit? I said, the battery's warrantied for five years. He goes, no, no, it's three years replacement. And you passed that. So I explained to him what the warranty was. And he goes, no, that's not what our warranties are anymore. So I said, yeah, I, I understand that's not what your warranty is today. But that's what your warranty was five years ago, when I, or three years ago, when I bought the battery. So he got the manager. And the manager goes, no, 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 that's not what our warranty is. I go, I just ran it off of your website. Advanced Auto. Right on your website. It says, you know, if it goes bad in the initial three-year warranty period, you get a free replacement. If it goes bad after that, you get a prorated replacement. He goes, can you show that to me? He's got computers all over the freaking place. Can you show that to me? So I send my son out to the car to get my phone, and I Google it up on my phone, and there it is. I show it to him. And he goes, oh, do you have your receipt? And I said, no, we started out with I don't have my receipt. So he says, well, then you're going to have to get uh, on the computer thing, uh, you know, to figure out when and when I bought it and how much I paid. Great. I can put it in the computer. It's one of the, you know, they do it by phone number. It's one of the, the three phone numbers, either my cell, my wife's cell, or my home phone. That's all it could be. He goes, oh, no, our computers are linked. Each store is separate. So every time you buy something from a separate advanced auto store, it doesn't communicate with the other store. So they don't know what your purchase is. Well, they can't even check to see if you bought something when you bring something back because none of the computers are linked up. Advanced Auto, standalone computers. It's 26, tomorrow, it'll be 2017. <coughs> so now, I said, okay, well, what do I do? He said, well, we gotta call the store. Can you get us the, can I get them the phone number to the store? So now I gotta go on my phone and I gotta try to figure out which store it was. Good thing I knew the name of the restaurant right next to the Advanced Auto, because that's what we were eating. So I Google up Angelo's Italian restaurant because Angelo's a family friend, and we were eating at Angelo's, and I get Angelo's address, and Angelo's zip, and I put the zip into the store locator, and I get the store, and it's two numbers off from Angelo's number, so I know that's the store. I give them the number. So they call the store. It, it took them 10 minutes to figure out how their phone system works so they can call Virginia. So what do they do? They call the store. I don't want to turn here. I want to go straight. Anyway, they turn, they call the store, and the store says, oh, no, we purge all our records after two years. So the guy goes, then how do you give somebody a refund on a, on a warranty? Oh, we, we just refund them the price. So down there, they just, re, you know, whatever it is on the shelf now, they get, they refund you that price. That'll be the purchase price. So if I was in Virginia right now, I'd have a new freaking battery. But I'm not. I'm stuck in this shitty cesspool of New York. And I don't have a battery. So now he says to me, he goes, well, they can't figure it out, so there's nothing we can do. Would you like to buy a new battery? I said, from you? I'm going to buy a battery from you that the, all I'm going to get now is a three-year warranty. Not even that. It's a two-year replacement warranty now. 
not a three-year. Now, if you buy it today, it's a two-year, and they, they prorate that last year, which they don't seem to know how to do. So it's like shitting it away. So I'm going to spend $140 on a battery with a two-year warranty. Are you out of your mind, a two-year warranty? Why would anybody buy a good battery anymore? Just buy the cheapest battery possible because it's only going to last two years, if that. It's such a crock of shit with these batteries. Batteries used to last five or six years with no problem. It's all horse shit. Horse shit. So what am I doing now? Now I'm driving to Sears. Because it's 425, they close at 6 o'clock, and I need a freaking battery. Otherwise, I'm shopping on New Year's Day for a battery for my wife's car. So, now we go to Sears. But Advance Auto stinks. They are the worst. They, their stores don't communicate, their batteries don't last, and they don't have any customer service skills whatsoever. And that's the Advance Auto. It's the first time I ever went in the place. The Advance Auto in Floral Park on Jericho Turnpike. I don't know if it's Floral Park. Could be Belrose. Could be Belrose. Belrose. Could be the Advanced Auto Parts in Belrose. That's Belrose, New York. Belrose Village. Belrose Village, whatever. It's, it's, it's over there. It's, they stink. They stink. Absolutely stink. If somebody from Advanced Auto Parts is seeing that, please, you stink. How do your stores not communicate? How does they call the store and they can't even verify the purchase of the actual store that I went to? After they it took them 10 minutes to figure out how to call another store. And I wasn't the only guy there trying to do the same thing with a battery. There was another guy down the other end of the counter that bought one locally from a different store. That guy just better grab his old battery and go back to the original store that he bought it from. It'll be worth the 20 minute ride. For me, it's six hours away. I can't do that. No warranty. No, we're not going to give you any warranty. You know what? They're going to give me the $5 core exchange, which I don't even want the $5 core exchange. I want to keep the old battery because I think you get more than $5 if you bring it to the scrap metal guy. Yeah. $5 core exchange. Scratch your ass, $5 core exchange. All right, so we went to Sears. Guess what? Sears had a shit selection. Man, I remember the day I used to go to Sears and get a diehard battery. Five year warranty. Man, the batteries were good. They lasted five years. Every once in a while, you'd get a battery that would go before the five years. All right, but it was uncommon. It was uncommon you got a battery then that didn't last the five years. Now they just all stink. They all stink. So I go to Sears, they have a horrible selection. And the same stupid warranty as Auto uh, Advanced. Advanced Auto? Advanced Auto. Same stupid warranty as Advanced Auto. Right, either a two-year battery or a three-year battery. That's it. They don't want to hear nothing else. So they don't have the two-year in stock. They only have the, the three-year. The Die Hard Gold. Boy, Die Hard must be rolling over in his grave. Die Hard Gold. Die Hard Gold. Three-year, that's it. If it makes it a day past three years, you're on your own. And guess what the price was? $154. Are you out of your freaking mind? $154 for a battery? Holy shit. With no warranty. How did technology improve everywhere, in every product, in everything, except for batteries? How is car battery technology so freaking crappy right now that they can't guarantee a battery anymore to give you a decent deal? <clears throat> Man, so what am I stuck doing? That's why I'd never say never, because now I'm going to another Advanced Auto, the store that I usually go to. I, I didn't go to this store <coughs> originally because it's a little bit farther than I normally go. But this is the store I usually go to because I'm usually, when, I, when I'm doing errands and stuff, it's this way. So I'm gonna stop here and see what they have to say. Worst case scenario, I gotta buy a battery. But Advance Auto and their warranties 
and their 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 stores that don't talk to each other, they stink. Stinks. Stinks. All right. Well, I went into this second Advance Auto, and wow, what a nice guy. He turns around and goes, yeah, I know what you're talking about, the old warranty, we used to prorate it, they don't do that anymore. He goes, uh, did you try calling the store to verify the purchase, because then we could, I go, yeah, they tried that, it didn't work. He goes, if you had your receipt, we'd have to honor it, but it really sucks, I understand that, so this is what I'm going to do. He goes, go for the gold battery, you get the three year warranty, it usually does last longer than three years. He goes, I'll give you 10% off of your troubles. He goes, um, there's a mail-in rebate, which the other guy didn't tell you. This guy was completely nice. So, Advance Auto and Hempstead, great guys, never had a problem there. Advance Auto as a company sucks. The, the whole battery warranty thing, yeah, we sold you a battery with a warranty, but during your warranty period, we decided to yank the warranty, and now there's no more warranty. So, you know what? You're on your own. And then I go to Sears, and Sears batteries are just a ridiculous amount more money. Um, this guy was actually really nice. He helped me out. I got a new battery. My wife can drive. Everybody's going to be happy, and I can calm down no more. But Advanced Auto, how you don't link your computers together, how you don't keep your receipts forever, keep your files forever, so that when they put in my phone number or my address or my email, the receipt comes up to verify my purchase. Why they can't do it from any store is beyond me. It's ridiculous. So, big thumbs down to Advance Auto. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video and my rant, because I'm losing my mind today. And that's it from Axel's Garage today. We'll see you next time.